you probably already know who I am. Um, uh, you may not know my face or my voice, but uh, I guarantee you, every one of you owns something that I've invented. Uh, it may seem like an impossible story, but uh, we've come to a point in our country where everyone has a hairy toilet. And it, you know, it, it, back in the year 2014, nobody would have thought that. Nobody would have thought, we need a hairy toilet. But uh, turns out, deep down, everybody was really interested. I remember uh, starting the idea, just thinking about it, and we all have used a toilet, and it's fine. Listen, I'm not trying to, uh, to talk down to people that use regular toilets, classic white porcelain. Sometimes you would have a shiny black toilet in your house. Um, urinals, things like that. But deep down what we all knew that we wanted was to be able to style our toilet's hair. We just started with the idea of putting a wig on top as a goof. You know, as you do, you have fun with your friends. Maybe you're having a party at your house. Excuse me, can I use the bathroom? Yes, it's right over there. Point over there, to the right. There it is. What's that? There's a wig on the toilet. <laughs> Where'd that come from? What a goof. You know, so uh, I was just kind of a goofball. Toilet wig guy, they called me. You know, it kind of went out from there. People, people were now, they would go to the toilet, and they would sit on it backwards, so they could look at the wig. They loved it. People loved staring at my toilet's wig. Maybe it humanized the, uh, maybe it humanized the toilet for them. It's a thing in your life you always take for granted. It's a piece of furniture in your house, sure. But where's its personality? Now, you can have a nice little buzz cut. Maybe a pompadour. From there, it just kind of got out of hand. Hair everywhere, long, beautiful, flowing locks of hair on all sides of the toilet. It's like some kind of hairy couch, but it's in the bathroom. What an idea. <laughs>